okay for many big button users and uh, uh, we always receive some questions or something like how can we share a screen to avoid the infinite loops the mirror effect like normally if you do a, a sharing uh, a, uh, your screen and you choose here and uh, share and you will see like a mirror right in infinite loops and um, yeah because it's uh, I mean it, it is uh, quite natural but uh, how it is not uh, looks good uh, for the users but how can we avoid this one okay today I'm going to show you this is the first things I'm going to show you how we can avoid this one and also the next thing is um, because when you share a screen normally like if you do it like this way and uh, then you go to the other page and you cannot see uh, the, the, the cameras or the, the, the other things not like uh, yeah because you always want to check what is being shared and uh, also their cameras it's, it's not working so how today I'm going to show you how we, we, we solve this problem okay so now uh, of this one okay so how the first how to avoid the mirror effect or the infinite loops the first thing is um, when you click share your screen you will see there are three options <coughs> you only can see the mirror effect if you choose the first one the total or the entire screen <coughs> but if you choose the second one or the third one you will not see the uh, the infinite loops or the mirror effect and uh, so the second one is for the windows the third one is for only one tap on your browsers so some someone may asking okay one tap is is okay but sometimes it's not convenient because I need to open another tap I need to show some other things then I have to end the share screen and go to another page or to share it again that's not really convenient okay now we can use this one I mean this is only for because most of the time most of the time I think this is really solve the problem most of the time you, you need a window you need a browser window so if you share a browser window entirely then mostly 90% you can solve the problem or you can share all the things you want to share it's not on your computers uh, totally but uh, uh, the windows uh, one window is enough like let me choose this one but uh, to choose this one you have to make one of your the I mean the the screen you want to share was live or active like now if uh, I go here because active it means it's open on the screen you see here okay and if you choose here here you will see the uh, the available option then you click here and uh, share okay now you will see there's no mirror effect and also there's no infinite loops is uh, is is good okay and uh, the next thing is uh, how can we see while we share the screen how can we see the user uh, camera and also of course we need to check what they see on, on, on screen so this is the tricks okay and uh, so you, you, you open you open two tabs or two screen or two windows on your, on your screen and uh, you just minimize or not minimize okay just uh, you need to adjust the size just make it uh, smaller and like this way okay or because for uh, yeah no that's that's all I think that's the, that's that's the smallest I can get but that's good okay so you can have two screens on your on your windows you, you can have two windows not two screens you can have two windows on your screen one is the things you want to share of the window of the browser window another part is the big button page you can still see the cameras 
right? And also you can still see the things or if someone sending the message or the things you are sharing. Like now if you're moving this, you see it's moving. And if you want to go to another Windows, it's also working. Or you want to search in some new things, it, it, it also works. I mean, that's, that's brilliant. And uh, yeah, that's the things. And uh, I think this is most of the things can solve uh, the problem of share screen, which you cannot see the user's uh, camera. And also, we, you cannot see, I mean, to avoid the, the, the infinite loops, the mirror effect. Okay, this is the thing. 